It's polygon time and on shape. Here we go. So, to create a polygon in on shape, you have two options. It can be an inscribed polygon or circumscribed polygon. You can also create a polygon by using lines or squares or however you want to go about it, but there is a way to automatically create one. So, the polygon tool is up by the arcs and whatever that is. <laughs> but, um, yes. So an inscribed polygon creates a polygon around a circle, circumscribed polygon is inside of a circle. There's not really much of a difference when it comes to like basic things, so it's going to be a similar polygon. So when you create one, you choose the center point and then you pick an edge. Now you can see that you can change the number of sides based off of where your mouse is. So you go in the directions of these two arrows, so three is the minimum, and then if I go this way, it goes up from there, up to like 50. Uh, once you have selected something, so let's say I have 10, if I escape and then go back and double click there, I can change it, so let's say I want 12 sides. It's like a dodecagon or something. I don't remember that name. Anyway. Now, if I wanted to do a circumscribed polygon, that's basically going to be like this, and it's the same idea with the number of sides. So, there's that. I can change it to be like six. There. So, the main difference here is that here the circle is on the inside, here the circle is on the outside. Alright, there are polygons.